Um, I grew up in a little town called Fairland, Indiana, which is about 25 minutes south of Indianapolis. I went to a 2A high school, I graduated with about 95 kids, most of us who had been together since kindergarten. I am married, uh, my husband Shane, uh, we've been married for 11 years. We have two children, Ava, who's a third grader, and Connor, who's a first grader. I love to travel. We travel frequently. Um, we love to go to Disney World as a family. It's one of the highlights of our year, every year when we go. Um, we like to be on the beach, be outdoors. Uh, I like to read when there's a quiet moment, which are few and far between. Um, and just, I guess, to spend a lot of time with the people that we love the most. I went to Indiana University in Bloomington. Um, I have my bachelor's degree from there, and then I have a master's degree from Indiana Wesleyan in uh, curriculum and instruction. I've known since second grade that I wanted to be a teacher. I've always liked working with kids and helping kids learn and grow and be their best selves. Some days are hard, um, no doubts about that, but it's very rewarding um, when you get to watch them have a moment where things come together for them. Those are the moments that teachers live for. Um, when you watch a student really struggle with something that's putting forth the most effort and really digging deep and trying to be their best selves, when everything comes together for them, it makes all of the extra work and the hard moments with that student really worthwhile. Every child's success is different. Every child is an individual and you celebrate those successes individually with each of those children. Watching the children put things together that maybe was a struggle at the beginning of the year and they've mastered it by the end of the year, regardless of where that is in comparison to their peers, that's what you want them to leave sixth grade feeling, is that success that they can then carry on hopefully to the junior and senior high. I expect them to give their personal best each day. And we're all gonna have bad days and that's okay to have an off day, but then you come back the next day ready to go. And I want them to try. And it's okay to get it wrong. It's okay to fail, it's okay to mess up. But as long as we're continuously putting forth the effort to be our personal best, that's what I want. And my students know that that's my expectation. I want my kids to know those expectations are gonna take you farther in life than anything else would. I would have to say my biggest inspiration would have to be my own teammates. Whether they're my teammate now or they were my teammate in the past, we just strive for the best and we strive to give our students the best. Uh, West Lafayette Intermediate is a dream place to work. I am surrounded by some of the most creative, out of the box thinkers that share ideas, that collaborate, that are your cheerleaders when you need somebody to pick you up who are there help you problem solve. I know I can go to any one of them and they're going to be supportive. And I may not have all the answers and they might not either, but we're going to work through everything together to best suit our kids. We're surrounded by administrators, Mrs. Passaros, Mrs. Qualio, Mrs. Harold, um, Dr. Killian, who respect us as professionals and they treat us as professionals and give me the freedom to do what I need to do to best help my students. What an amazing place this building truly is. It's really hard to put into words quite the feeling that, that goes with winning the Golden Apple. It is a very humbling experience. It is quite the amazing feeling to be recognized when you work amongst such amazing people and for your efforts and your time and your commitment and your passion to be honored in such a way. It, is very validating for all of the work that you put forth and to win a golden apple I feel like I have to be doing something right so I'm going to keep plugging away and keep trying to reach as many kids as I can. Trying to get the best out of each kid is really what drives the whole process.